So today is the big day. Dr. Lewis is gonna get his official wedding ceremony. But for the whole week, I get to live like a king, baby. Oh yeah, all that is where I'm staying. Follow me. Welcome to my crib. What's <laughs> good, oh, good, fam? What's good? <laughs> As y'all can see, this is a three-story house, 14 bedroom. I don't know how many bathrooms, a lot of bathrooms. There's the man of the hour. It's his day. What's up, baby? Say something to the camera, man. Last time they saw you, you was becoming a doctor. <laughs> now they see he got, look, you see them shades? That's what happens after you become a doctor. Hey. You get fancy braids nice. and you get fancy houses. <laughs> Lewis, man. First off, they said I was supposed to ask you something about some shoes. You were. Let me, oh. let me make this phone call real quick. <laughs> so we supposed to wear loafers like point toe loafers? I don't own point toe loafers. He want me to wear his, but he said my feet were gonna stink. What kind of friends hey, did man? I said put on some socks. <laughs> that's Trey, that's my guy back here. I don't know where he at. That's kind of creepy, that face you putting on. <laughs> we'll take him off the lens for a minute. But today is gonna be a big day, and I'm excited for it. We got the breakfast done. Later on today, I'm gonna Everybody's been eating. They did not clean the pool area. We're kind of upset about that, because we're supposed to spend a lot of time out they there. They said black people can't swim, so what's the point? <laughs> <laughs> What's good, YouTube? So, ready for my man's official big day. There's the father there trying to slide through. Had to get him on there. You, I won't let you go like that. But let's go upstairs. Check out everybody else. Show, looking good. Everybody, there you go. That's what I was looking for. Come on around here, Morpheus. It's for you, baby. Don't shoot the bird. Don't shoot the bird. It's for you, baby. Oh, appreciate okay, it. It's good for you, man. Yes, it does. Oh, we gotta turn away from all that light. The man of the hour, right there. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Don't say something to him, man. You know you don't never talk. Every time I pull up the camera, you don't hey, just just tell it's your people. <laughs> He sucks. He sucks. He ain't gonna talk either. He's been saying that all night. Yo, <laughs> baby. We don't want to take ten shots, man. There ain't no ten shots. You, you know what? I'm gonna put this in here so y'all can see what I've been dealing with my whole life. Hi, Jess. Look at her. She's so beautiful. Oh, I'm gonna drop a tear. And then we got the ladies over here. This one kind of mean, but she cool with me. There they go. They all looking good. Solo, you ruining the lady's shot, man. You ruining the lady's shot. Y'all check those out. Those are crazy, ain't they? Those is loafs. Cortez is vows. That's beautiful. So I walked in here and I thought this was a mannequin, but then he blinked. He's real. And my of course, my, move. My Get my out the plank, way, bro. man. Get out the way. Take, snap me up. Hold up, man. I just noticed something. Oh, that's crazy. I'm too See? close. Yo, there you go. Just get me right here on the side. Point out. So, what's up, man? I'm taking over the camera today. I'm taking over everything today. I'm gonna be the MC. I'm gonna be the cameraman. I'm gonna be everything good. How y'all doing? My name is Julius Cornelius Lightfoot III. You can call me Julius Cornelius Lightfoot III. Um, what's up? How we doing? Let's go. That's the real reason why everybody's here is Anton. <laughs> That's the real reason right there. Look at him. So yeah, this is the behind the scenes before everybody starts eating. See this? Look. Should I do it like this when I do it? Yeah, it's better. Instead of doing it like this. Now I know. Lights out, lying in your arms and these feet. I don't know 
because on some level we can really picture God as someone who just makes beautiful things. But in this light, especially as Christians, as followers of Jesus who honor such texts as these, God doesn't just make things beautiful, He manifests beauty. It's His personality. He just can't help. Just like when Cortez looks at Jessica, right? I hope. She just can't help but be beautiful. <laughs> so, everything's going on right now. But I just want to give a shout out to the true hero. He goes, he makes Adam, and he says, This guy, man. It's not good. <laughs> Sorry, that's not good. <laughs> it's almost like it's a complete. That's Iron Man. And so the crown of the here. Repeat after me. Cortez, do you take this woman, Jessica, to be your wedded wife? Again. Say that one more time. <laughs> Now, the couple for this vow renewal obviously has prepared their own vows. Jessica, you have the perfect example of God's grace and love in our marriage. Five years into marriage, and you continue to choose me each and every day. Mm -hmm. I'm undeserving, and I know this, and I just want to say thank you. Today, I vow to be a better husband. That looks different for every marriage, but for us, I vow to be more comforted. Okay. In your moments of sickness, babe, how are you feeling? Can I get you anything? In your moments of sadness, babe, can I sit next to you, keep you company? You're beautiful. I don't say it enough, but reminders are necessary. I'll do better. Your wife, mother, entrepreneur, and so much more. I vow to inform you in all those areas. I love you. I could probably say it a lot more. <laughs> <laughs> Let's continue to live life together, travel, raise our kids, and make memories. Hmm. Thank you for letting God to meet you where you are, for being vulnerable, for sacrificing your pride your comfortable lifestyle, and all that you have ever known to make a choice that will change generations and bondage and change. The sacrifice you made against your flesh daily, not even for yourself, but for our sons. I am truly grateful, and I thank you. I thank you for setting an example, even though it's far from glamorous, for my brothers, for my male friends, for your male friends, of what it looks like to struggle to be a hot man. <laughs> by speaking this truth, I vow to love you forever and ever, no matter the <laughs> And now by the authority, by the Almighty God, I pronounce you again <laughs> husband and wife in the name of Jesus Christ you may Kiss your bride. Okay. <laughs> Alright, so the vow renewal part is over. We're about to do like the reception, family photos, things like that. My feet were hurting, it was super hot, but it was cool. I liked it. I really liked that my boy Cortez spoke from his heart. I tell you, oh, <laughs> one second, please. So, um, yeah, I like that he kept it from his heart. It sounded like him. His vow sounded like something that he would say. And with me knowing him literally my whole life, I knew that that came straight from in there. And it was beautiful. I mean, Jess's were too. They really were. But it was great. So now we're about to dance and party. And it's time to switch outfits and do our thing.
What's going on, Lewis family? Sorry that I'm so sweaty. I've been running around, you know, trying to catch everybody so that they could put this little thing together for y'all. Just a small way of saying thank you, man. You know, um, it's been a long run. Uh, from way back to when I nicknamed you Rufus, to the church parking lot fight, to becoming men on the track, to becoming men in real life, man. It's been a good run. Um, I'm just so grateful for you, bro. You know, um, I always said you were my dark twin. Um, but as I watch you continue to grow and develop, you know, I see a lot of pieces of you that I want to take and make myself. And just being here this weekend was just a strong reminder that we all can do better. You know, we all strive to have something beautiful with you and Jessica. And Jess, I've been knowing you for a while. We, we aren't super, super close, but you're a sister. And you with my boy, you family to me, so. If you ever need anything from me, I got your back. Um, I'm just thankful for being able to be here with y'all and share this moment with y'all. And like, you know, I just look forward to what's next. And when it's my turn to come down that aisle, I want to be as hype as y'all were, man. Uh, and I want y'all to ever side me to do it. So thank you. Love y'all. 